Craven County is receiving $50,000 to help combat opioid abuse. Trillium Healthcare awarded the money to the county's opioid task force. News Channel 12 star Connor is live tonight with more on the donation. And star, how's this going to help with fighting the overdoses? Well, Craven County's task force coordinator says that the $50,000 in grants will help them purchase more than 2,000 doses of Narcan. Now, that can help reverse an opioid, opioid overdose. Now, one person I spoke to, he says that he's happy to see that the county is doing this to help save lives. Jesse Torres is a recovering heroin user. He's been clean now for three months. Torres says he's excited that Craven County is doing something to help those who are overdosing. It will save a lot of lives. Um, I can really vouch for it because it saved me. I saved other people. The 35-year-old says he started using drugs at only eight years old. He says Craven County is high in overdoses. Um, fentanyl is now mixed with everything. Here in Craven County, it's became one of the worst um, worst places to get drugs. Um, everything is laced with fentanyl, and fentanyl is really killing everybody. Craven County Opioid Task Force Coordinator Jasmine Kennedy says that Craven County is in the top 10 in the state for overdoses. Well, we're losing families. We're losing mothers, daughters, sons, cousins, neighbors. I mean, it doesn't discriminate. Kennedy says Narcan will be distributed to volunteer fire rescue squads, city fire departments, police departments, and the Craven County Sheriff's Office. She adds that they will be getting more Narcan over the naloxone because the nasal spray goes towards the brain to help revive someone faster. County, I just want them to know that Craven County is doing their part of this big, huge fight in the middle of a huge crisis. We are doing our part. We are taking a stand and we are definitely in the fight. For Torres, he says the county getting more Narcan is what's best for the future. I reached my bottom and today I am grateful for this, for the Narcan, because it gave me another, another chance in life. And I try to carry this with me everywhere I go so I can give it to somebody else so I can save somebody's lives. Now, the Narcan doses will be distributed sometime soon. Um, Kennedy says that she will be providing training and education classes for all of the agencies involved. In Craven County, I'm Star Connor for News Channel 12.